Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to SimCity. We're in crisis mode. We need more power. More power! No, really, we need more power. Like, you wouldn't believe. I act... Just look at the population. That's all I have to say. We're in trouble. The population has just been exploding. Furiously. Higher. Come on, we need more. We need more power! Like I said, the population's been exploding furiously. The traffic system's holding up pretty well, actually. There's a couple of jam-ups during rush hour, but that's to be expected in any city. It's just like real life. I've even gotten the taxes down by 2% on everybody. Love seeing the crime prevention van. Always good. Um, what I think I'm going to do, though, is raise taxes to normal, and then I don't need those growing. I need these growing. This is what I want growing. You know, I want residential growth. I'm kind of hoping they'll eventually recognize that I've given them a tax break. But, nevertheless. Oh god. The pipes are backed up. Oh dear. That's a minor problem. Totally handleable. Just another tank of sewage treatment and we're good. See? No problems. Though the problem still remains that this area isn't even getting power. Even though we have a ridiculous excess. It's pretty much like I said, because the packets move around pretty much randomly underground. So you start noticing that they don't properly get here. And a lot of the time power misses out. And this is why a lot of this isn't upgraded. Like you, you see that this is a lot of this just is an upgrade. It's because what makes me unhappy, we'd like some power, please. And there's nothing I can do about this. It's effectively a problem in, with the game engine itself. Yeah, we're closing in on that. And I think last of the industries upgraded. Uh, one thing I can do. is to drop down additional coal stacks. Like that. And that will ensure that we have so much excess power. Even though it comes at a small cost, I know. And that's okay. Also, the other thing is, look at our residential density. We have huge room for expansion here. It's actually worrying how much we could pot potentially stand to expand. Or, potentially, uh, potentially expand. You guys don't even love the tax break I've given you. Wow, these rich are snobby. And <laughs> six percent taxes isn't low enough for them to get considered a tax break. Ooh, we almost have a, uh, a we almost had an upgrade this time. Yeah, we're doing good here, and we now should have hopefully enough power that even over here will upgrade. At least that's what I'm kind of hoping. Uh, power. I know I've been saying for a really long time that we'll be moving to another city, and I really mean it. I'm trying to get ready to go. But stuff just keeps cropping up that needs doing here. The other thing is we have actually no low-wealth residential demand. We have filled all the jobs. It's impressive. I'm very impressed by this. Um. Yeah, seriously, you guys aren't even taking the tax break. Didn't find work. Well, uh, and how low can it go? I think two percent's the lowest it'll go, which is fine, I guess. That should really spike a uh, growth of, 
you know, love the low tax rate. And this should spike a huge growth of uh, various things along various areas, and should increase the population even further. Who knows, and I think probably today we're actually going to get another university upgrade. Which is great, considering, again, we're still the only city in the region. And the fact that I managed to pull this off is impressive. I didn't think I could grow a city to be this awesome without, you know, having any partners. I've been playing this game all along, apparently. To get this city hall upgrade would just be great. Get Department of Transportation in this. And the only thing left would, I'd need would be tourism. Although I'd never actually get tourism, I don't think. Probably because the final upgrade probably requires like 600,000 people. But yeah, let's go take a look at the achievements real quick. <clears throat> I got Billionaire's Playground while we were off camera. 10 high density, high wealth residential buildings. Actually, surprised we haven't gotten the big insert fruit here and skyscraper magnet. <laughs> I, I, I vaguely expected that we'd be getting that. We're going to see them upgrading now, too. I think we can drive this tax rate even lower. Yeah, we can. We're just going to see the uh, tax rate and everyone's happiness go through the roof. Alright, fine. Just to be on the safe side, 2%. just to be on the safe side. And we've paid off the bonds, so that's very good as well. Yep, come on. Start upgrading around here. I want to see upgrades! Out of money. Alright. I expected that people would be out of money. It's kind of a thing that has to occur at this point, I think. And here's hoping that we get the uh, university upgrade today as well. Come on, I'd really like to start a new city, but shit's, it, shit's just going too good. What do you want? Is the city hall not receiving power again? Worker shortage. Two out of three, that is. Alright, alright. I think we're starting to see some growth in somewhere. Yeah, overall, regardless, we're just seeing, you know, growth among the medium wealth, too. I think that's actually maybe where we should focus the effort. Wait, that was commercial low wealth that I just dropped. That's the one I want to drop. And like a stone. There we go. Now, all that is medium wealth. I command thy to rise! Like I said, we're even getting some low wealth tenements there. Not enough room to increase density. Not. Aw, oh, god damn it, really? They apparently don't have enough room to increase density, which kind of sucks. I guess I didn't quite make this roomy enough, as it were. Yeah, looks like it. Well, hopefully this will push any that can upgrade over the edge. This is the third set of classes, so... Hopefully we make it to 1,500 and can, you know, get somewhere there. I'm really hoping. Still got a bunch of random industry growing all over the place. Oh yeah, all this stuff over here can grow. Yeah, we're starting to reduce the uh, low wealth or low density even more. That's great. Worried about pollution. We seem to have caught, caught a cold. Yeah, alright. <laughs> I want to try and beat away the gray. That low-density crap. Totally don't want. Hmm. Alright. Kind 
kind of hoping that these guys will start upgrading. And, yeah. So that that's doing well. Yeah, it's unfilled medium wealth jobs. I can't seem to do it. Can't seem to do it any further. We're at 251,000, and I think this is the best we're going to get. I can't increase it any further. That's it. We're kaput. Kaput, I say. We can restore tax rate to normal. 10%. 12,000 an hour. Yeah, we're, 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 at our, we're at the end of the city's uh, ability to grow, really. Which is fine. It's not a bad thing. If we get more cities in this area around here, then we'll be able to grow the city even further. Things like places to ship freight will help. Um, jobs for like jobs in other places will also help. And things like that. That will all help. And eventually we might even be able to uh, get another city hall upgrade. Like I said, 250,000 is really pushing limits here. And we don't even have any abandoned buildings. Like, this is the best we can do for the city. And it's a significant improvement over my last one. Over my last main city, definitely an improvement, and you know what? It's okay. I learned. That's what's important. Hmm. Uh, yeah, I don't think we're going to make that. Oh, well. Yeah, that's it. We're going to have to make a uh, new city. Well done, nevertheless, for me. I did it. I did well. 256,000, wow. Alright, well, we're done here. That's it. Let's go. Into the new city we go. Next time on SimCity.